Namaste, I'm Liz Reed. Today, India is at the forefront of visual and voice search adoption globally. And there is still so much opportunity to meet people's information needs. With the advances in AI, I truly believe the best of Google search is yet to come. Today, we're excited to give you a glimpse into how our investments in AI and machine learning are making search more helpful than ever before in India. We're accomplishing this by doing three things. First, we're making it easier for people to search and explore information visually. Second, we're building a more intuitive search experience in Indian languages. And third, we're enhancing our voice capabilities for diverse speakers so they truly can work for everyone. Sometimes it's just really hard to put things into words. For example, you might see an interesting flower and want to know what it's called, but you'd have no idea on how to describe it in text. So we reimagine Google Search with Lens to help you find information about what you see using your camera or an image. And we've seen that being able to search visually is particularly important here in India, where more people use Lens every month than in any other country in the world. <laughs> However, people explore information in more than one way. We rely on our many senses to help us understand the world around us. And so with the power of AI, we're combining our deep understanding of information across multiple modes to help you ask questions and explore information more naturally than ever. We see this as a new era of search, where you can find what you're looking for by combining images, sound, text, and speech. And a great example of this is with multi-search. In the Google app, you can take a picture or use a screenshot, and then you can add text to your question just as you might naturally point at something and then ask a question about it to the person next to you. So let's see how it works. Let's say I'm out shopping and I see a beautiful fabric pattern that catches my eye. But I might want to find a dress in that same pattern online, and I couldn't do that by just a picture or words. And so how would I describe this in a search box? So now I can take a picture of the fabric, and Lens does its thing to start with by showing me many similar fabrics. But now with multi-search, I can also add a text query, just add the word dress. And just like that, I can now get to explore many dresses with a similar pattern. Another critical form of visual information, particularly in India, is video. But what if that thing you're searching for is buried inside the long video? Videos are skimmable, but it's really time consuming to go back and forth and try and find something specific. Or if you're using an audio transcription, then you have to get the exact word to search. So we've already used advanced AI to identify key moments in videos for you to help. But today, we're taking this a step further. We are piloting a new feature that lets you search directly within the videos. Now, when you watch a long video about Agra on your phone, you'll be able to search for anything mentioned in it and find exactly what you're looking for in the moment. For example, in this video, if you want to search for the magnificent Fatehpur Sikri, you'll be able to type in your query and jump directly to that exact second. Being a Fauji kid and growing up in A4 stations all over India, I've personally got to interact with people of different languages and different backgrounds. For instance, many people in India often type queries in English, but prefer to see results in their own language. In fact, majority of Google users in India consume more than one language. So we're leveraging our advanced machine learning based translation models and a cross-language search technology to introduce an India-first innovation, making search result pages bilingual for people who prefer it that way. Now, we'll proactively serve high-quality search results in the local language alongside English results within the one box, top stories, and people also ask sections. We've already started rolling this out in Hindi, and we'll be expanding this to other Indian languages, including Tamil, Telugu, Marathi, and Bengali in the coming year. Today, many people, including new internet users, are finding information and getting things done online by simply speaking in their own language. Indians are at the forefront of adopting voice search. For instance, many Hindi language speakers naturally speak English rather than pure Hindi. 
We want to help these English speakers talk to technology the same way we talk at home. Understanding words in mixed language in a single query and delivering the most relevant results in real time is not an easy challenge for computers. I'm excited to share that voice search can now better understand people who speak in English. We're doing this by combining the power of several statistical models into a large neural network inspired end-to-end -end speech recognition model that takes into account the individual's accents, surrounding sounds, context, and speaking styles. Many people take for granted that when they speak, they will be heard, they'll be understood. But it's estimated that 250 million people worldwide have non-standard speech. For them, communicating with others and being easily understood can be very difficult. So following years of research, we decided to create Project Relate, an app that's custom trained to unique speech patterns of people with non-standard speech. The Relate app has three built-in features, listen, repeat, and assistant. Listen transcribes the speech in real time. Repeat repeats what the speaker has said in a clear, computerized voice. And Assistant allows users to speak directly to their Google Assistant from within the Relate app. We've been piloting the app with English users in India. And today, I'm happy to announce that we're planning to expand this pilot to Hindi users in early 2023. The many ways Indians have embraced technology to enrich their lives inspires us again and again to innovate and deliver even more meaningful experiences. And we really look forward to continue building the future of search with all of you.